Neil Carlson here with a quick recap of some incidents around the Northern Valley on this Sunday. This Sunday morning, a helicopter was called into northwest Minnesota to find a teenager who had left a suicide note last night. The teen was found safe this morning and taken to a hospital for an evaluation. Then, during the noon hour, we've had two separate serious accidents over the noon hour on this Sunday. Here's the first emergency call as it came in at noon today. Erskine First Responders, please respond to Winnie Mac Travel Center. Adult male was in a motorcycle accident at the railroad tracks on Highway 2, brought himself to the Travel Center. Um, he did crack his uh, helmet in the accident, page set 12 o'clock. No details on that accident yet or exactly what that motorcyclist hit, but as you heard, the crash was hard enough to crack his helmet. Now, at almost the same time, just a short uh, distance north of Erskine, we've had a one-car rollover. The Highway Patrol, State Patrol, and uh, Polk County Sheriff's Department is on the scene. Uh, apparent injuries uh, with at least uh, one person trapped in the car. Then, just before 1 p.m. this Sunday, uh, fire crews have just responded to uh, one, two, uh, maybe two or three different fires along the railroad tracks here. This is out at UMC. You can see in the background uh, fire crews just uh, going out on the scene here. There was some scanner traffic that this possibly could have been caused by a passing train when you get uh, bearings or wheels locking up and uh, emitting a shower of sparks. Uh, no word on what caused this yet. We've got uh, maybe one, two small uh, fires along the tracks here. Nothing major, nothing uh, threatened at this point. Then at 3.50 p.m. on South Washington Street in Grand Forks, fire crews called to Taco Bell. All fire units and all true, all fire units and all true, Taco Bell, 1301 South Wash for a fire smoke call, no flames. Fire was out when crews arrived on the scene. Then at 4.30 p.m. on this Sunday, police called to North 3rd Street in downtown Grand Forks for a subject who had apparently got into an argument with a bartender and his girlfriend and walked out of the bar and down to another bar down the street. Three police officers and sheriff's deputies were on the scene, no arrest, and almost at the same time, other officers responding to a report of an individual who may have been threatening suicide. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for inews.tv.